Hi, and welcome to U.S. History, week 20. So, today, uh, this week, we're going to go through critical moments in U.S. history, focusing on the rise of populism, the significance of economic issues in the late 1800s, the challenges faced by farmers during this era, and the emergence of prog uh, progressivism in comparison to populism. So we're going to start by analyzing the rise of populism in the United States. In the late 19th century, a populist movement emerged, driven by the grievances of farmers and the working class against powerful economic and political elites. Populist leaders like William Jennings Bryan advocated for the free coinage of silver, creating a bimetallic currency system that would ease the burden on de debt-ridden farmers. The Populist Party, formed in the 1890s, sought to address economic inequality, advocating for reforms such as direct election of senators and an income tax. The movement's influence extended beyond its political victories, leaving an enduring impact on American political discourse. So then we'll be shifting our focus to the broader economic landscape, the late 1800s were marked by profound economic changes. Industrialization led to the rise of powerful corporations, contributing to income inequality and monopolistic practices. Economic issues took center stage in political debates, as the nation grappled with questions of labor rights, corporate power, and financial policies. This era saw the emergence of economic theory, like capitalism, and the widespread debate over the gold standard versus the silver standard, with significant consequences for the country's economic direction. So then we'll be zooming in on the challenges faced by farmers in the late 1800s. It becomes evident that they bore the brunt of economic transformations. So technological advancements increased productivity, but also led to overproduction and falling commodity prices. Farmers faced high transportation costs and exorbitant interest rates, often resulting in debt and foreclosure. The agrarian or agricultural discontent culminated in movements like the Farmers Alliance, reflecting the shared struggles of rural communities and setting the stage for a populist uprising. Finally, we'll delve into the causes of progressivism and compare it to populism. Now, both movements emerged in response to economic and social challenges, but differed in their approaches. Progressivism, flourishing in the early 20th century, sought to address urbanization, industrialization, and corruption in government and business. Unlike populism, progressivism had a more urban and middle-class base, advocating for direct democracy, regulatory reforms, and social justice. While populism focused on rural and agrarian concerns, progressivism aimed at broader societal reforms, leading to significant legislative changes, such as the Pure Food and Drug Act and the establishment of the Federal Reserve. Finally, we'll be ending our week with the A3 exam. The study guide is on BC. You'll find it on the date of the exam, that being February 8th, 2024. So I hope you look uh, deep and um, into the study guide and prepare as best as you can. Thank you, and I look forward to seeing you all and working with you next week. Thank you.